No other country in the world has granted such a comprehensive loan moratorium like Malaysia. In fact, most countries only provide targeted or limited loan assistance, said Finance Minister Tengku Datuk Seri Zafrul Abdul Aziz in the 59th Implementation and Coordination Unit between national agencies report yesterday. The latest loan moratorium under the RM150 Bill National People's Wellbeing and Economic Recovery Package is the second all-inclusive moratorium that has been rolled out by the government after it was first introduced in March last year. Tenku Zafrul stressed that the moratorium facility did not mean loans were forgiven but that there would be no compounded interest or no interest charged on interest. Tenku Zafrul added that for those who choose to extend the loan repayment period longer than the original period, the interest to be paid will definitely be higher but the matter has to be negotiated with the respective banks. Any borrower who is still facing difficulties after consulting with their bank can contact bnmtelelink at bnm.my slash rasurvey. added that it needs to be seen along with the government's efforts to accelerate the transition to the next phase of the movement control order. The six-month moratorium is offered to all individual borrowers and micro-entrepreneurs, without imposing conditions such as income reduction or job loss. No further documentation needs to be submitted and the borrower only needs to sign an agreement to amend the relevant loan terms. The moratorium package is estimated to provide a relief of up to RM80 bill to individual and business borrowers.